my name is Karuna Singh and welcome to the channel Knowledge Star Continuous Knowledge Excellence. In this video, we will get to know about the glycol chitosan nanogel for tumor targeting. Now, our expert, Professor Himadri B. Bohidar, who is associated with National Center Excellence in Agro Nanotechnology, Delhi Daikan Nanotechnology Center, India. He has 31 years of academic experience in teaching and research. His area of expertise includes nanoscience and nanotechnology, nanobio interface science, soft matter science, polymer physics, biophysics. We'll explain you in detail about this topic. So to get complete information, watch full video without skip. Here we'll be using again a nanozel for tumor targeting. Now in the treatment of cancer, a patient comes to a stage where the chemotherapy treatment becomes essential and this situation cannot be avoided. But there are many associated problems here. One is the high dose that is utilized in the chemotherapeutic protocols, non-specificity and many times the inappropriate tumor selectivity. So this gives rise to multiple problems, collateral problems. One being the healthy cells around the tumor, they get destroyed. Overdose of the drug leads to a lot of side effects. Wait, wait, wait. Are you worried about your project, training, dissertation, internship? Don't think too much because Nanoscience and Technology Consortium in short, NSTC is giving you a golden opportunity to do the same tasks. NSTC also conducts workshop on amazing topics. So if you want to register in the workshop, the registration link is given in the description box below. Or you may go to the website www.nanoschool.in where you can easily enroll in the workshops. So just check it out right now. And patient goes through a lot of trauma. And the most important thing is because of the excessive doses of drug, drug used in this treatment protocol, the patient sometimes develops a drug resistance, which is very, very dangerous. And this ultimately often leads to recurrence of tumors. So again, the problem comes back to what we have been talking about for so long. Can we deliver the drug to the site at a lower dose so that the bioavailability of the drug to the cancer site is adequate for the cancer to be treated locally? So that is what is the spirit of this work. There are two challenges here. One is, of course, we have to make a nanogel which will carry the drug to the target. And secondly, at the target, we should be able to release the drug from the nanogel. So these two things have to be kept in mind. And let's see, how do we approach this problem? I hope you like this video. Here, I would like to give you an important information that Nanoscience and Technology Consortium organized the nanotechnology workshops on very interesting topics. Also, I would like to tell you about the initiatives of NSTC in which you can also be a part of mentorship, Patent commercialization, joint product development, research projects, consultancy services, nanomaterials for your research projects, training programs or customized training programs, workshops or customized workshops. So that's all. If you want to see these type of informative, educational and interesting videos, then please do comment and subscribe to the channel Knowledge Star and hit the bell icon to never ever miss an update. Thank you everyone. Thank you so much. For more updates, subscribe to our channel. Click the links shown on the screen to stay connected.